What is going on ladies and gents? How are you doing? Welcome back to another football reaction video watching the Portugal and the France game in the UEFA Nations League. Hopefully it's not going to be another draw, but let's see what happens. I personally think that Portugal will win 2-1 with Ronaldo scoring the game winner. That's my prediction. I just realized that France don't have Kylian Mbappe in their starting lineup, but Coman's quick dribbling ability is just absolutely incredible. I mean, his quick feet movement can be the biggest difference maker in this game. And Coman just had an incredible shot right there by Rui Patricio with a great save. But yo, Coman, I think he can score a G. And what an incredible build-up by France right there. Griezmann with a nice pass to Martial, but Rui Patricio comes up big with a great save. But I think Martial should have chipped the keeper right there, because if I was Martial, I would have chipped the keeper. In the last five minutes of the game, France have just been absolutely all over Portugal's defense, but surprisingly, France haven't scored yet. I don't know how they haven't scored it because they have all the momentum right now. I don't know what to say right now, but France are just getting very, very unlucky because, I mean, seriously, what a great free kick by Griezmann, but they hit the crossbar, so that was just absolute bad luck. What can I say, man? Rui Patricio is just having a heck of a game right now. He's single-handedly keeping this game scoreless because if it wasn't for Rui Patricio, France would be winning this game 2-0. Like, seriously, Patricio, man, incredible, incredible, incredible. Currently, a couple of minutes right into the second half, man, Cristiano Ronaldo already with a great free kick, but I don't know why no Portugal player went for that ball. Like, that was just absolutely shocking because that definitely should have been a goal for Portugal. It could have been a goal if somebody had just tapped the ball in because that was just an easy opportunity. And Le France has finally scored. Quel but France. Oh my gosh. Look at that finally. You see, this is what I'm talking to you about. Kante with the goal. Pour les bleus to give him a 1-0 lead. Les bleus finally in the lead against Portugal. You see, oh, look at that beautiful setup. Rabiot. No, wait, that was Griezmann, I think. And boom. Hoo-hoo. Kante. Ladies and gents, the game is still 1-0 for France, but Portugal are still pushing for that equalizer, but great defending by France. And look at that prevented and potential equalizer right there from Ronaldo. Great freaking defending France. But I don't know what's going on with Martial in this game because Martial, I feel like, completely underperformed today. I mean, I don't know how he missed those chances. And ladies and gents, that's the end of the game. Portugal loses 1-0 to France. France gets that W, so big win for France today. But I personally think that Martial, he needs to work on his finishing because tonight Martial's finishing was pretty abysmal, I have to say. And also, I think he made some questionable decisions tonight i also think his decision making tonight wasn't the best but regardless man france they got that w and that's what matters at the end of the day conte in my opinion without a doubt man the match he scored that goal but i think lucas hernandez he played pretty decent today for france you know i think lucas hernandez had a pretty respectable game but france man tonight they just uh, they just gave it all and you got to give it up to him for them to win 1-0 against portugal without Kylian mbappe is something special so france they can really go far in this tournament in my personal opinion but in other news switzerland and spain draw one one and the thing about the switzerland spain game is once again man spain despite dominating time possession they failed to get a win but they draw but switzerland they played pretty well tonight i have to say against uh, against spain you know despite them not having more possession they still were able to do a really great job you know of just being able to create chances against spain because honestly dude i don't know what it is with spain but spain right now i feel like just are not that team they used to be i feel like spain are kind of in decline because I mean, really, Spain are completely underperforming in the Nations League at the moment right now. Like, there's no other way to say this, man. Seriously, they're just absolutely underperforming. And in other news, Germany, they win 3-1 against the Ukraine. Timo Werner had a great game today. So, a Germany, they got they finally managed to get a win in the Euro Nations League. And then Sweden, they win 2-1 against Croatia. So, those are the results of the uh, UEFA Nations League day tonight. Tomorrow is going to be the Poland-Italy game. This is going to be a very, very good game. Hopefully, Poland can get that win because I'm going to be playing for them. Hopefully, Lewandowski can have a big game tomorrow. But, hey, we'll see what happens, man. But regardless, man, big win for France, man. Incredible win. And I think this one can, be, can, can make the biggest difference for France because now I think they can qualify and secure this top, top spot in the group. But anyways, ladies and gents, that's the video. Hope you enjoyed this. If you did, smash the like button. Please subscribe to my channel. You know, help me get to 20,000 subscribers. That's the goal currently on this channel. And also, don't forget to follow me on Twitch. Link is below in the description box. 